Hey everybody, my name is Skitton and welcome back for another video of Dying Light 2. We're back here, boys. We're about to, uh, we're about to basically uh, do the parkour thingy. We need to go to the penthouse right here right in the middle of nighttime. Uh, as I'm talking, I've been doing uh, one side quest in particular, which was considering the guy that was actually, uh, if you remember, in, in the stretcher and stuff, it was actually Ador. That uh, uh, the guy that was, uh, was working with us the entire time with the PK on Old Villador. Uh, we ended up um, doing a side quest for him, trying to help him out, giving him some medicine. But uh, at the end of the mission, uh, turns out it was, uh, you had a choice. Like four different types of choices. One of them was to give him the right, uh, the right medicine. Another one was to give him the wrong medicine. Another one was to not do anything whatsoever. Basically let him die. Or um, the other one was... Uh, there was another one where you uh, you could call Lawan uh, for suggestions. What I ended up doing is... Uh, I basically made the worst decision whatsoever. I made... Um, because I, I, I thought it was going to be a bluff or something. Because uh, apparently there was something about... Um, uh, the, uh, his wife telling me that the medication that was prescribed that was supposed to be the right one was the wrong one so I thought oh maybe I'm gonna go inverted and actually pick the wrong one maybe it's gonna be the actual right medication whatever I'm not sure if you guys follow me but uh, I uh, short the short thing uh, short story is I gave him the wrong medicine and Ador ended up dying boys so I accidentally killed off that character which is not the best of solution gotta tell you that for sure not the best of solution but uh you know it is what it is uh killed him now there's not much else we can do about that uh, unfortunately uh we uh are basically screwed up big time now he's basically dead and we got one less friend or i i guess he wasn't really our friend but he was our good partner you know he was really a nice uh, a nice fellow a nice guy to work with and it's just a shame in my opinion that uh, <laughs> I picked up the wrong item in order to kill him I kind of did it on purpose at the same time but you know it is what it is all right so we're supposed to go upstairs a little bit here is there a way for me to go up it's got to be a way for me to go up right because the uh, they want me to go down right here that's not what I want to do I want to I want to go upstairs all right there we go Right here, boys. We're supposed to find like some good stuff for uh, like good stuff through loot and, and all. We'll see if that's the case or whatnot. I don't know if it is gonna be the case. We're gonna find out. I don't see anything. Find valuables in Yuan's apartment. I don't see anything. Oh, what about this? Uh, for Yuan in the apartment. Okay. Oh, there you go. There's a tape. Some sort of tape, but I don't. I can't find anything right now. What about this, though? The one? There's nothing left in here. Yeah, there's nothing here. Daniel said it's a virgin spot. Keep looking. Well, there's there's probably a hidden spot, a hidden door, or something. But damn! All right, so he left with his painting, a uh, paintings, but he didn't leave. Instead of choosing his wife, he chose his painting, uh, paintings. Ain't that something, boys? Okay, well, I'm guessing that's the clue, the biggest clue right there. 18th century sketch, okay. Ah, a list of what he took, it seems. Juan would be pleased. Well, he would be pleased, but uh, fortunately, we don't have anything left. Investigation? What about this? Voice message from 5.36 p.m. Mr. Bukowski, your transport is en route to you. The art collection should be on the roof already. The one. I think I found his stash. A helicopter was coming for this guy. They sent everything to the roof. I'm headed there to look. Good luck. Oh, to the roof? You mean to tell me it fell? What, did he die or something? In the roof? Maybe he died on the roof and uh, all of his stuff is still there. Okay. Well, in that case, let's go there, boys. And my immunity is going down a little bit. Uh, because it's nighttime and all. Let me see really quick. Uh, there's some uh, pop-up right here. I don't care about that. Anything on the roof? 
the helicopter would have been there so I don't see anything boys I don't see anything available oh hold on hold on there's something here oh that must be him it must be him right here ah, fuck there aren't any paintings left everything's been destroyed hey Luan found our collector but no sign of his collection Luan hey you there Jesus Aiden I told you I was leaving yeah stop panicking okay, quick thing. I like how Aiden every time he doesn't get an answer straight away he starts panicking and is like Luan 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 please answer me it's like damn chill I think he's got a he's, he's got a big fear of being uh, rejected or something I don't know what's going on with him okay I'll go there and listen that vodka Danier is a big fan Okay. Planning to drop by, which you probably aren't. So he's a big fan of that car, I guess. Really whatever. To this, city, this is the way. Just saying. Yeah, whatever. Whatever you're saying. It doesn't matter to me, man. Alright, let's take that vodka. Take the liquor and I'll give it to him, I guess. So, uh, attend Daniel's party or talk to Yuan again. So we can do either one. So we can attend the party and uh, and stuff. Uh, parties are not for me. I'll be honest, parties have never been for me. So we'll just go talk to Luan instead. Uh, uh, or Yuan. We're gonna talk to Yuan and uh, maybe he's got... Maybe he's gonna be warming up to me. Somehow, if we're lucky enough, he'll probably um, be willing to help us. As I'm gonna die right here because why not? We're back at the base. Here we go, boys. Getting ready to talk with that guy. Hopefully, he's gonna be willing this time around to talk with me. Whatever. Yeah, I mean, I think he's probably done partying at this point. Hopefully. All I want, really, is just, just for him to literally give me what I want. I mean, I that's all I need. I just need him to cooperate, please. It's not that complicated to cooperate with a fellow friend or something, right? Come on now, he knows who I am too, so... It's not, there's no reason as to why he shouldn't be like... A little bit more friendly towards me, so... Let's see if he's in, in his cabins, he probably is by now. Uh, with uh, his French girlfriend. Let's find out. snack isn't he dear care to join more the merrier I'll chill no, even though it would be fun to have a a three a threesome I'm sorry I'm not there for that I'll wait for you but to make it quick I must admit I admire your persistence almost curious what you do after I send you packing yet again You'll regret it. Sixteen-year-old Highland single malt. Modeled a year before the pandemic broke out. I've read that one barrel of this stuff sold at auction for over half a million dollars. Uh, what a sublime present. That's it. A vodka is a sublime present. Whatever, boys. I'm not gonna argue. I mean, whatever works, works, I guess. This guy is, uh... He's not too complicated, I guess, with his gifts. Drink? Nah, I don't drink. I'm good. You're right. Better don't mix work and romance. Bad outcomes. What can I say? You broke down my defenses. So, you're still after those lamps? Yes, I am. Did Matt tell you why he wanted them? Why he really wanted them? Does that really yeah, matter? To take control of the TV tower. Wait, he's serious? Is he crazy? 
Nobody tried that for over a decade. Why is it dangerous? Well, Matt wants to protect the city. What do you know? Matt wants like to a normal to being. The city from the butcher's coming attack. So we should start building him a monument, right? Only problem? The butcher isn't planning any attack. How do you know? I have my spies. Among the renegades as well. Since the end of the war, we have occupied the city center. While the colonel squats in the dam. One push of a lever. And half the city will find itself under toxic water. The colonel is not stupid. He knows war would be the end of everything. What about these lamps? Well, why did uh, the renegades attack the canteen? And what about the lamps? What about the UV lamps? Why does he want them then? Jack is hiding something. For a while now, he's been ordering way more lamps than he could possibly need. And then some of those lamps always disappear. No accounting for them once we deliver. Well, what do you have in mind? Why would Jack skim UV lamps? And here, friend, the mystery takes flight. Jack never got over the fact that he didn't defeat the Butcher back when he had the chance, years ago. He knew that if he attacked the dam, the Colonel would close the floodgates. And the rising water levels would push the chemicals up out of the ground, burning through everything that lives in the city. It's been a stalemate for over ten years. Each waiting for the other to make a move. But then... Someone turned the power on and something changed. And the renegades attacked the canteen. Okay. I'm not here for my health, Juan. Well, that's kind of... I, I mean... To find out what happened to Walt's uh, turned the power on, but... I told you I'm pretty sure it's him who did it. Why, though? Not, uh, that, that I don't know. And your sister, specifically about the GRE scientist you and Matt are trying to contact. I'd even say with my resources I can find this person faster than Matt. I actually doubt he's able to find them at all. So you do know about my stuff. I'll stick with Matt. I can help you. He says I he can probably help me faster than Matt. I'm not sure, boys. I've been with the PK forever now. I'm gonna stick with Matt. How do I know you're not using me to make a move of your own? I'm not your enemy, Aiden. It's a shame you don't see that. You'll get your lamps. You just gotta talk to Demolan. Who's he? He's my man. Sent him out to search for more lamps, but he hasn't checked in for a while. Where can I find him? Around here. Last I heard from him. Find him. Then come back to me here afterward. You got it. Yeah, it was... All, as much as it was tempting to mind. work with him instead of Matt. And to literally possibly get the easier route. I am not too sure about this guy and plus I've been working with the PK forever now boys. They've been my friends, they've been friendly to me. Uh, and I feel like I'm going the PK route, I gotta go all the way out boys. All the way on it. I can't just uh, choose to betray them whenever I want or I wish. It just doesn't work that way for me. I feel like I chose a route and I'm gonna stick to it. I'm gonna stick to uh, work with uh, working with the PK and no, nobody else. So, whatever the uh, the PK, the lieutenant, whoever works for for the PK, whatever they want from me, I'll give it to them. I'll work with them, and that's just it. I won't like go out of my way to do anything else, uh, really. So I'm I'm just gonna. Uh, I mean, it was a shame that I couldn't save Ador. I actually killed him myself uh, by accident, but. Um, for the rest, I feel like I really, really need to stick with the PK's orders. Stick with what they uh, they want me to do, to uh, for the most part. So, uh, I guess we'll interact with the, this guy that he talked to me about. His uh, his henchman or whatever, and he's probably gonna give me the lamps I'm uh, I need. You know, I just need the lamps, please. Now, yes, it is fishy that uh, Jack Matt needs lamps for some reason. It is a really fishy, but uh, what what can you do really, right? I don't care what if it's fishy or not. Ador has his had his moments as well where it was pretty uh, pretty weird for him to do stuff like this. But uh, I ended up working with him anyways. That's what working with the PK is all about, boys. 
You take the bad and the good. You take both. You know, you, you learn to end all uh, these things. So, can I shoot him? Let me see. I don't have any arrows. Yeah, I don't have any arrows. That's a problem. So, I gotta buy some arrows somehow. Let me uh, deal with that, uh, that uh, beast, whatever, right now. There we go. Just deal with him. Because I couldn't, I couldn't enter the place without, uh, without dealing with all these zombies first. So am I gonna have to deal with him as well? Are you shitting me? All right, it looks like I'm gonna have to deal with that one as well. That's annoying. Come on. All right, deal with him. Search, search him as well. He's gonna give me a non-common uh, trophy. As many trophies as I can get, boys. Now please tell me I can get in. Finally. Okay, brand new beast boys, brand new boss. This looks like a goddamn titan, like like for the uh, Batman Arkham series, doesn't it? Looks like uh, the, the goons uh, with the titans uh, on him. It literally looks like that. Okay, you're going down, buddy. There we go. Look how much damage I'm doing fast. Oh, now, he did push me quite a bit. And he's got a chill as well. Okay, there we go. Oh, what the fuck? That was something. That, that was definitely something right there. Okay, well, chill. Zombies across the, uh, the place right here. Get him. What the hell? Yo, they're rushing at me. Okay, I got a chill. Yo, he's throwing rocks. This guy's crazy. Wrecking Ball is his name as well. Okay. No, you don't. Got you. He's dead. Okay, so uh, there's one more zombie I gotta deal with. Or actually a couple of them. They're coming at my face. Yeah, I gotta handle them, boys. Find the missing squad and also kill the remaining infectees, uh, infected. So, just gotta kill them really quick. You don't. Alright, come at me. Come at me, bitch. Alright, got him. That should be all of them. I'm actually gonna loot from him because I want the, that trophy of his. Definitely want that. And, uh, unfortunately... Don't have any health thingy, so can't go inside. So that's too bad. Good job, man. You showed him. You're a goddamn superhero. That beast had us trapped here. Wouldn't go away. It attacked us right as we got here. Mark got hurt pretty bad. We barely escaped and huddled up here. Finally went quiet not long ago. We thought that thing had wandered off. Next thing we hear is you banging on our barricade, and then it all started again. I'm looking for Demolin. You guys seen him? Up top. All right, Dad. Uh, come on. Let's get you to a doctor. They're in pretty bad shape, it looks like, boys. Uh, let's go meet with Demolin and see if he's got the UV lamps for me, boys. Hopefully he does. Let's go. Uh, hopefully you guys are... Um, uh, liking the series i am enjoying quite a lot dying light 2 i wasn't expecting it to uh, enjoy it as much but i really like playing this game Aiden. nice to meet you your skills are exceptional and you don't look like a peacekeeper to me so who are you ask about the lamps i i don't i don't i'm not gonna tell you about myself that's uh, just gonna be uh, a mystery to you my sir my good sir Juan told me to check up on you and the lamps. Ah, the lamps. Piece of cake, he says. <laughs> no such luck. We found a few, but it wasn't what you would call a bountiful harvest. And it came at great cost. The corporal killed by the beast outside has a brother in the unit. He will be devastated. He is at present with a squad down south on the lower dam promenade. They have not reported in. That doesn't sound good. We need to find him. The boy's mother lost her husband in a dark zone just last week. Now, a son. If her other son were to perish, it would be too much for any mother to bear. I'll try to find him. Okay. The boy's name is Sebastian. The islands are a dangerous area. Worse since the renegades overran them. Okay, so this is basically becoming uh, Saving Private uh, Sebastian, boys. It's literally what it's becoming. Where's Tom Hanks at? All right, boys. I guess we're gonna have to find that guy. And uh, for all extended, all extended purposes, try and save his ass. All right, let's go. 
Where's he at? He's all the way over there too. Probably gonna have to transition. Uh, probably. Uh, uh, yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this series. I am enjoying this series quite a lot. Uh, this is a really, really fun game. Uh, the parkour. It, uh, it's always been fun to me ever since I played the uh, Assassin's Creed Great. game. I've already uh, had fun playing uh, parkour games, but this is on another level. This is next level parkour. Obviously, I knew that from the first game, but second game is even better. So that's awesome. We are closing in, boys. It's right there, right in this location. Let me drop down. There we go. Every time I drop, I'm kind of scared I'm gonna die because I end up dying quite often just by falling I, I never die because of the, the infected shit slash zombies I always die because I fall to my death it's always the same reason boys it has to be part of something the butcher and Waltz are brewing but why now I don't know why now so kill the renegades find the missing supply unit got you kill the zombies first there we go. Okay, so uh, yeah, I guess we gotta kill those renegades. It's not. It's gonna be an easy job. Let me just deal the uh, uh, deal with them real quick, boys. Uh, yeah, I just they've got a bunch of uh, archers as well. Uh, this makes it a little bit more easier for me as well to deal with them. Why did I? Oh my God! He keeps pushing me back and stuff. Yo, you're annoying, buddy. There we go. Get out of my face. No, you don't. Kill him off. That all of them? Alright, that should be all of them, boys. Okay, so I think we're good. Uh, now what, though? Find the missing there. supply. Answer me now. Oh, that, that's gotta be him. I think he's dead. That's unfortunate. Found your men. Um, some of them, at least. I'm sorry to say. They're dead. Aiden? You sure? How many? Two bodies, both quite dead. The squad had five men. There are three others. There's still hope. Okay, I'll look for them. All right then. Well, where they, would they be though? The three other men. Not too sure, boys. Survivor sense. Where would the other men be? I'm not like. How would I find them? I'm not gonna have to fight that thing. This path. is not good. Like Holy mad. shit! They say it's a side quest, boys. And they go wild. Wait, I gotta go upstairs. Uh, Yo, what the crazy, fuck, man? Like they say. Chill. Crazy and unpredictable. They're level five as well. This is not good, boys. I'm not like they do more damage than they should. Throw it! I dare you! I dare you to throw it. There we go. Throw a fire on your ass. Okay, we're gonna get him. Oh my god, like a football player boys tackling me. This guy's crazy. All right, I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get the monster. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yo, he's, he's strong. Watch out now boys. Watch out. Okay, yeah, get him, get him, get him, get him. Keep getting him right here. Shit. He does a lot of damage though and I don't have any medicine. I don't have any medicine. I gotta be careful. I don't want to die right now uh, fighting him and having to respawn again. It's kind of uh, annoying, to be honest. Okay. He keeps tackling, boys. There we go. Keep attacking him from the back. Get him. Get him. Get him. There we go. Step up. Step up. Step down. Every time, boys. Dodge and weave. Dodge and weave. Here go. 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 We almost got him. Get him. One more time. Got him. All right. He's dead. That's one side quest done. That's one mini uh, quest. He is dead hard. Well, that was a um, that was a tough one. Definitely a tough one. All right, can I get the rope? All right, I gotta get to the rope somehow. Can't get there, boys. Okay, I'm just gonna have to jump from here, and then I'm gonna be able to do that. Wait, I I gotta jump probably from there, right? All right, there we go. Just like that. Got it. There's more dead bodies though. Not gonna help me. Found him. What do you mean found them? They're all the, all the way over there. Okay, I'll go save them. I'll go save them. No problem. Just deal with them. Uh, these guys, really quick. 
There we go. These two are dead. Is there more enemies I gotta fight? Yes. They're on this side, probably. Right? Oh, there's a goon right here, actually. No, you don't. Kill you, kill you off. Right, get out of there. Get out of there. Alright, I'm gonna fight them. And, uh, yeah, I guess I'm just gonna jump. Right there. They're right here. Let me save them really quick. I gotta... Gotta go inside. Relax. That's Down gotta be the two... Okay, one of them must be Sebastian, boys. If we're lucky, that is. There's still enemies nearby. You gotta be shitting me, boys. This guy right here is gonna be a problem. You're gonna be a problem. Alright. Alright. Come at me, then. No, you don't. You die today. Alright? You're gonna be a problem for me. No. I don't think so. No, okay. I think we're good, boys. I don't think there's any more enemies. I think I dealt with all of them. So we're good. Let me interact with him. Hey, you guys all right? Me? Yeah. Sebastian, not so much. Oh, that's Sebastian. Okay. Uh, what about the lamps? I'm sure I'll be fine. But I was sent here for the lamps. Where are they? After we drove off the renegades, we reached the building. To get in, we strung some ropes across from the next roof. And that's when the renegades attacked again. And the lamps? They're still on the landing pad on the roof. The military hit them well. Made sure no one could see them from above. Seba only saw them from the next building, through binoculars. But we didn't get a chance to finish securing the ropes. Is there any other way to get there? You could go through the building, but like I said, wall-to-wall -wall biters. I gotcha. I'll try the rope. You'd have to be a spider to climb in. And it's swarming with renegades outside. Don't worry about that Take one. chances. I'll take my chances. Take exactly. I'll get what I need. Tell him what happened here. I'll go get those lamps. Well, all right. Yeah, I'm not gonna help Sebastian. I don't have time for that shit. I'm here for one thing and one thing only: the UV lamps, boys. And nobody care about the Sebastian anymore. He's safe and secure. That's all that matters. All right, let's go. Let's go get ourselves the UV lamps. We know where they are. They're on top of that roof. Uh, I'm probably. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna just do that really quick. That did not work uh, how I wanted it to work. I'm just gonna uh, go into the uh, that ventilation system right here and head back again. All right, yeah, let's try this again. I probably yeah I'm supposed to do that like that. There we go. We're supposed to run uh, at it, not uh, zip line through it. Okay, this is gonna be bad. There is it is swarming with. Uh, with infectees. Well, there is a biohazard right here. Some stuff for me. And uh, 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 as well, uh, some inhibitors, which is going to be really helpful for me. Aside from that, I don't see anything. I really don't see anything. Uh, I do have some health thingy, finally. Some bandages, boys. That's going to be helpful. But uh, I don't see anything in the region that would indicate me... That uh, this is where I want to uh, be at, right? So, uh, search of containers for UV lamps. Oh, there it is. There's the containers. Is that, is that supposed to be it? Let me find out really quick. There's a medium lockpick right here. Okay, so yeah, this is definitely the right path. Good. Take that. Lockpick this. See if we can find anything. Okay, so we did get something. It's not like I can go inside here, right? Oh, fuck. Fell down again. Is that inside right here? Maybe it's inside. I can find some stuff. I mean, there's another crate. So maybe that's what I'm looking for. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. That doesn't sound good. Not again. Another one? Really? Yo, chill out, man. How many? Okay. All right. Don't worry about it, Luan. I'm good. All right, so we're going to get out of this what? situation in the next video. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. Keep it easy.